Okay, it's very important that you do it this way that I'm about to tell you, okay? So, again, this little shuffle should just be a part of your DNA, okay? This is what we're trying to get. So you could do any, you could talk about stuff, you could be walking down the street, you could be chewing gum, you could be playing the saxophone, but this you could be able to do no matter what. It's our shuffle, okay? So, again, it's the key that unlocks all music. That swing. So here we go. Uh, this, I'm going to break down the bass line and how I want you to practice it because we have to relearn it. Relearning it is ten times harder than just learning it the first time. So, I'll play the whole thing first. beginning it's pretty simple you know this the entire thing is on this timeline there's a timeline this dot 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 you're either playing with a, a knee slap or not but the knee slap does not change ba 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 that's like that's a rock that's solid that's your foundation so in the beginning we start together okay That part you've got, that's not a big deal. This is the part that's confusing. But if you get this rhythm and these rhythmic components, these happen all the time. And once you know them, you know them. And you'll be able to transfer this to all kinds of other bass lines, melodies, all kinds of stuff. So we're gonna start the same as the other one. We go. Okay, that's our first piece on F. And then our second, so do that. Get that really ingrained in your system. The second piece is the A flat that we hold. We go together right, together right, together right, together right. Just be able to do this. This is a really important skill in music. Okay? And then the third piece is right together on the C. Right together, right together, right together, right together. And the final piece, there's four, I lied. Uh, right, F, right together. Okay, so piece one, ba, da, da. Piece two, and piece three, and piece four. Okay, so when we put them together, I'd practice each one individually, and then put them together. So put the first two together. Okay, you got to be able to do that before you move on. You, if you can't do that, you can't move on. So you go, right? And then remind yourself of what that is. So we got to go, and ba, and ba, and ba. And then I like to do the last two just to connect. And then we can do the whole thing. Okay? And then you're back at the top. And you're going to start over. the same rhythm but instead of going up to the C you go down to the F so figure that out and then the very last thing bah, that's a little
you should keep this going actually. Okay.